The Antarctic Ocean is one of the last virgin expanses on the planet. An ocean full of life, essential for the well-being of our planet and our survival as a species. This is the inside story of a mission that has brought together people from all over the world to put pressure on governments from 26 nations to create the largest marine sanctuary in the Antarctic. We have eight months to gather 1.8 million signatures. We know that if we are going to change politics, we need to create noise. Amigos, nos vamos de embajadores de Greenpeace a documentar y testificar la belleza de uno de los lugares más increíbles del planeta. Creo en la importancia de conservar los océanos y para mí es un privilegio poder estar aquí y servir como comunicador de lo que estoy viendo. Do you really have to shoot this? <laughs> I can kill it! <laughs> now there's just constant tourism traffic. Estamos en este sitio y aparece otro barco. Esto es como Santa Bola. There's real urgency in protecting Antarctic waters because they're under threat from expanding fisheries, particularly krill. Without krill, everything breaks down. A sanctuary would prevent corporations from depriving penguins, birds and whales of this essential sustenance. We can try to do our part to prevent it. <laughs> It's a part of the new world kinder. How long am I going to stay down there? How long would you like to stay down there? Five minutes? It will take you 20 minutes to get there. Don't touch anything, especially the red body. <laughs> No pensaba que en un sitio así hubiese tanta vida debajo de estas aguas. Debemos ser testigos de esto para protegerlo. Celebrities like Javier Bardem reach people that I never could. I think a lot of people are not going to be very interested in what I have to say, but if Javier speaks, I think they may pay a little bit more attention. I have to be optimistic, yes. I couldn't do this for 30 years thinking there's no end to it. If the people wake up, realize what we have to lose, they might get away from their screens for a while. It's just a matter of will by decision makers and especially by politicians. Si conseguimos millones de firmas, si tienen un peso, si funcionan, si es así, es que estas cosas funcionan. You're going to be sitting on the biggest dirty pile there was. You might have lots of money, but you, you can't eat money. Politicians listen to people. We think that they don't, but we know sure. that they do. I have witnessed the wonders of the last virgin continent on the planet. Now, we face our final challenge.